Hello, Adrian Cosman Jones here from Onsite Helper. We're a Google partner, and today I want to talk about advanced email protection with encryption using a thing called S-MIME. So what is S-MIME? S-MIME stands for Secure Multipurpose Internet Mail Extensions. And what that actually is, is it encrypts your emails uh, to prevent them from having unwanted access. Another feature that actually does is it digitally signs your emails as well. And what that means is uh, it puts like a little signature onto your email. So when you send an email uh, to someone, they can actually see that this, this email is digitally signed. It actually verifies that it really is you who sent it. Um, and same vice versa. If you do receive emails and someone does have SMIME, you can see that that email is verified. It's a bit like uh, HTTPS instead of HTTP, that it's actually um, you know, got a digital certificate against it to show that it's a legit website. So this means it's very effective um, against phishing. And phishing is a common uh, tactic by cyber criminals. And what it means is they often will send an, an email or, or some type of communication to someone um, asking them to provide them with, let's say, a credential. It could be a trick, like a link. They click on the link, asking them to sign into a Google Doc or something like that. And once they, that person gives them their credentials, then they, they're fished for it and then they can then access it on behalf of that person um, and, and those emails are compromised. Um, so it also, what it does is it protects your emails uh, which are at rest um, or in transit within um, sort of servers. So a lot of email providers uh, encrypt uh, emails by default when in transit over the internet, but when they're actually at rest or in between your local servers, they're no longer encrypted. And this is a vulnerability where cyber criminals can get in and uh, get access to your emails if they're not encrypted. And in fact, in 2016, uh, this, this did occur, um, a famous scenario where 20,000 emails during a US election were, were compromised and, and issued on Wikilinks. And in fact, a lot of people say this is uh, what caused the downfall um, of Hillary Clinton at the time, um, as there was a lot of confidential information exposed during that. Um, so, Email encryptions or well, SMIME is highly recommended for any organizations which are dealing with sensitive emails. Um, and if you're interested, it's, a, it's available for uh, G Suite Enterprise and Education. So if you've got G Suite Basic or Business, um, you can speak to us about upgrading to G Suite Enterprise and having this uh, set up for you. Finally, I'm going to pass this on to my one of my senior engineers, JD, who's going to show you a demonstration of how to actually set this up in a G Suite account. Hello, we're going to show you how to create your certificate for your SMIME or client certificate that you can use to install on your Gmail for SMIME security protection. Upon purchasing your certificate, open the email and copy the link from your certificate vendor it's important to use a browser like Firefox ESR, this one, because Firefox ESR is one of the few browsers that offers passwords for your certificate. So I already downloaded that on the bottom, and then I am going to paste this. It will tell me um you know i'm sh are you sure you want to download it uh you can read this if you want i am going to agree i already read this from my previous installation click generate okay so the certificate has been installed on my firefox esr browser what i'm going to do now is i'm going to export that Go to Options and then Privacy and Security. View Certificates. And this is what I want to export. So I'm going to highlight that and then click Backup. I'm just going to install it in my SMIME here, the folder. And name it Help Desk SMIME. Uh, you can name it anything you want, um, regardless. Um, so I'm, I'm going to make it shorter. I just want to 
of the cert. Save. So this is the password that um, I was talking about. So I'm just going to create a password um, for this certificate. Let me just um, do it now. So after we created the password, um, we have saved the certificate in the SMIME folder that I created earlier. So this is now the certificate that we want to upload to either or export to either Google Chrome or um, Microsoft Edge Chromium. So in this example, I'm going to use Chromium. I am going to just go to the settings and then click privacy. So to go to settings, just click this uh, three dots here. The ellipsis, uh, click settings like that, go to privacy. And then we're going to go to manage certificates. All right, so we want to export or import, rather, sorry. Click next. We're going to choose the SMIME um, certificate that I created. So just click the drop down and click all files. And open next um, we're going to just use the same password that I used earlier and then I want to mark this key as exportable because later on we're going to export that and we're going to import it to Gmail to configure our S mine and um, save it so click next next Next, finish, and it will be imported successfully like that. So what I want to do, like what I said earlier, we want to um, import this now to Gmail so that we can use the certificate to sign our email for SMIME. I'm going to highlight that and then click on export. And then I want to click yes for the export the private key. We need that. And then uh, let's just review this really quick. So include all certificates. This is what we want. Um, no, we don't want to delete the private key if the export is successful. We, we need the private key because Google will ask for that for the S mine. And um, everything is OK. So click Next. The password, again, we're going to um, just use the same. Now for the encryption, we advise you to use, of course, uh, 256. SHA for SMIME and then click next file name just put the help desk um, cert or actually I can just put HD cert this time and click um, next we're going to yep, save it in the same folder SMIME click finish okay so we're going to close that. Now we're going to go back to Gmail and then we're going to click settings and see all settings. And then we're going to accounts and edit info. All right. Now, as you notice, there's an option here that says enhance encryption as mime use this certificate so you will only see this if you enable the s mime um, on your G Suite admin console so it's a really easy thing to do um, we have that on an, another video we can uh, that we showed how to do that or you can just quickly Google how to enable s mime that is just a few clicks up uh, you know on your G uh, G Suite admin console so Without further ado, let's upload the certificate that we created. So S mime. Um, this is the one, right? I name it HD cert. And then the password that I use, I'm gonna add that. And we're gonna wait for um, Gmail to authenticate. Alright, so we have this now.
All right, we can now use the certificate that we created. I'm going to click close and then I'm going to go to inbox and then we are going to compose an email to my other email address. I'm just going to name it test s mime. Voila. <laughs> Send it. Let's see if this is going to be instantaneous. Um, we're going to just load that. Refresh that. It didn't go to spam. Did it? I doubt. No. Yeah. I'm just gonna go back here, and we're gonna wait for. Uh, you know, while we're waiting, I'm gonna pause the video. Okay, that took another 30 seconds after I paused the video. So I'm gonna, just gonna click this email from um, help desk and click this. Now you see that it says enhanced inscription as mime is enabled security with a green padlock. Verified email address sender. Now my email also has um, as mime. So if I reply to this one, I got it. Click send. And going to the help desk inbox here. Again, let's pause the video. Maybe it will take a couple of minutes. All right, so yep, it took another minute after I paused the video. I'm going to click that, and as you can see, mine is also S mine encrypted. So both email are using SMIME encryption to protect the email. So there you have it. That's how you um, create your client or SMIME certificate using Firefox with ESR and then uploading it to Chrome or MS Edge Chromium and then exporting it again to create the certificate that you will finally upload to your Gmail. Hope uh, you guys uh, enjoyed this video and um, help you. So long. Thank you. Bye-bye.